Okay, I'm back. And now you can get to see the super special awesome thing that happens after you get the orb. Oh, the suspense. Ooh, the suspense. I interrupt this episode as part to bring this important announcement. I'm going to go I'm going to see you. You hacks or zombies or I'm going Rainbows are cool. Are you A Z N? I'm the little little I'm 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 DBC is so so good. I are Jeff Lowe. Knuckles Adventure for the win, made by Aaron Bago. Not by the Spyro. That's right. You waited us all this time to watch your eyes bleed. Totally not worth it. Alright, now let's go and get the magic jar teleportation. Yeah, as many of you have heard by now, um, the next part will be my last part. I have lost my disc to this game, so I can't play it anymore. But as to... As many people have asked, and by many, I mean one, that when I do find this disc, I will be continuing this walkthrough. Because it's a really fun game. And not to mention there's that super mysterious door that in Dragon Shores, it won't open unless you've gotten every single gem and every single orb in the entire game. I, of course, have been through the door. Wow. So anyway, we're going back to Autumn Plains. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to hop in this water and get these gems that I haven't gotten yet. Yeah, I'm going to be starting a, Sonic, a walkthrough of Sec Sonic Adventure 1. And so, since I don't want this to happen to that walkthrough, I have already recorded every single part of that walkthrough. That way, in case I lose that disc, I've got all the parts on my computer. We're going into Crystal Glacier now. Gotta break in like super secret ninjas. They fail. They were not super secret ninja. Unlike me. I am super secret ninja. Spiral, the ice wizards have imprisoned our leader, Shaman Tuck. Can you help us rescue him? It is urgent. He has our tickets to the night hockey game in Palacis Valley. Oh my gosh, hockey game in Colossus. Gotta go see that. If you get on the catapult, we'll help you across the chasm. So now they form a human ladder. And then this happens. 
Oh my gosh. You kill the ice things with your flame attack? I never would have guessed that. I also never would have guessed that snowballs could hurt you. It's fun to watch those jars go explode and then go 50 feet in the air. This play time you have to flame four people. Only one left. Yay! Wait, how do you get frozen again? Yay! Yay! Oh. Gotta go kill this thing. Okay, now when I unfreeze him, he'll tell me that he'll help me. Somehow. By, um... Wow, that's a good idea. All right, now that I don't need them anymore, why don't they just stand there and hang there forever? To get the talisman in level in the level, all you gotta do is just flame all the Eskimos and get them unfrozen. Pretty simple. Now, when you come over here, guess here you um you get these gems. And over in this area, guess who you get the presence of seeing again? Oh, look it! It's the fat bear of doom. Always wanting to take your money. Don't worry. If I ever get to the end of this game, I'll sh I'll show you the. I'd love to show you the scene where you get to take all the money back. Moneybags is the final boss in this game. He's the hardest boss ever. Every time you flame him, a gem pops out. And every time you charge him, a gem pops out. So you have to hit him and for every gem he's taken from you. Then when the bag is empty, then one final flame kills him. It's really epic. For an attack, he reaches in the bag and chucks gems at you. Yes, Pyro. I could arrange for you to cross this bridge for a small fee. I'll do it for a small fee. Two million gems. Now I can buy that condo in Hurricost that I've been wanting for so long. Go ahead across the bridge. He wants a condo in Hurricost? That place sucks. Alright. Whatever. You have to buy it or else you can't finish the level. Ah! Ah! No, I don't want to die. I don't want to die. No! Wow. Is that the first time I've ever died in this walkthrough? I think it might be. I think that might be the very first time I've died in the entire what playthrough of this game? Those dragons are gonna pay. They are going to pay with their lives. I don't care if they multiply and they breed faster than rabbits. I'm going to kill them all. Talk to this guy. This whole area is infested with creepy dracolets. You might be able to help us get rid of them if you can fly. So you get the Superfly power-up when you kill 15 people. So I'm only missing two. Well, anyway, you want to come down here and get all these gems, because when you're flying through getting all the draglets, you don't have time to stop and get gems. I just like to flame them, because I think it helps. But like I mentioned, they breed at a rate faster than rabbits.
And I might be able to show you what their breeding looks like. Oh, you there it happened right in the background, but you didn't get but you probably didn't see it because you weren't paying attention. Maybe I'll show you. Sit and actually wait for it to breed, and I'll show you what it looks like. The entire birthing process of the Draculets is so well developed. It's amazing. Well, that's about my time. So, I guess I'll have to go. See you next part.